Welcome back, guys, to another episode on the Internation server. Today, we are going to be going and we are going to be building. Possibly caving. Alright, so pretty much what I'm going to do is I'm going to gather supplies. But welcome back. I'm glad you guys enjoyed the first episode of the new server. I really like that. I saw quite a bit of support from everyone. Really made me happy. So the first thing I want to do before we get started here is we are going to kill this cow. I don't know why they keep on getting out. It's really starting to annoy me that I don't, I don't... I mean, I'll show you guys what setup I have too. It's like, how are you guys getting out? Really, how are, how are they getting out? It's protected, double protected, and... I don't see any way for them to hop over the fence. Unless someone keeps on letting them out. I don't know, but it's really starting to annoy me that I keep on seeing cows out. Or they might just be uh, glitching through the fence. That could be another possibility. You guys are glitchy. Glitch cows. Alright, so the first thing I want to show you is something I made uh, actually earlier today. And I'll just show you all the mechanics behind it. This, if uh, if you guys have watched the Minecraft server, oh hey buddy, You're Golden Villager, how are you? Gonna drop something for me? Oh, that's rotten flesh. All right. So uh, if you guys have watched the Minecraft server, you know about this. This is called the Death Games, and I built this. Uh, it's not really supposed to be like a super fancy building or anything. Oh, my keyboard is not working. Oh, there we go. <laughs> For a second there, it freezed up. So, uh, yeah, this is the Death Games. And uh, pretty much what it is, is it's, if you guys have watched the Minecraft server, it's sort of like a, uh, a game where if a name... Let's actually go inside. If a name pops in this chest, or this one down here, then I have the right to go and kill them. This is the armor setup that we have. And uh, thanks to that skeleton farm that we have just uh, up there that got blown up last episode. Oh, spooky cave noises. Got blown up last episode. I did go ahead and I did fix that. So that is all good and dandy. Let us uh, let me see if I can show you. Ooh, let me get my axe. And let's go ahead and go on down here so I can actually show you guys if it'll let me down. So let's go this way. <laughs> so this is the inside redstone mechanics. Pretty much what happens is whenever there is a name in the chest after a uh, one day cycle, so whenever this turns to night, let me actually I'm gonna break that and that. So after one night cycle this unpowers, and right before it does it, or actually, yeah, unpowers, and then in the next day cycle it powers and it sends one pulse through. If this is pushed here, where I'm standing, it'll continue through and go to this torch, allowing this hopper to be unlocked and putting the names back in here. So I do have them in there for right now. We, uh, we just have to wait one day cycle. This right here is just to uh, get it all started. This You don't really need this afterwards. So uh, that's about it. If, uh, if you do want to see the redstone tutorial, I will, uh, I'll be linking it in the description for the, uh, the one I saw to actually help me get this going. Because if you guys have, uh, if you guys know me, I'm not redstone savvy, but this was pretty simple to to make. It wasn't too bad. I actually just followed it and paused the video every now and then. So, that's about it. And as you guys know, I am all alone. All alone. Recording early in the morning. So then that way, I can actually get this video out today. Because that's what I like to do. Get videos out. So, uh, what we're going to be building is I'm actually going to go and I am going to go and make... Or, oh, I just kept on repeating myself there. We're going to go find a place to, uh, away from spawn, to actually go and build our home. Like our legitimate house, where we'll actually go and get all 
with our supplies and we'll actually be set up fully because I mean this is just a spawn house I don't actually intend on living there forever let me see is there any wheat in here I know there's arrows in here <laughs> all right well let's harvest some wheat and then that way we can actually go ahead and get all that there we go. We got 47 wheat. Mm-mm-mm. 47 wheat. Though I feel that there should be one more piece. I may have just missed it. This is an even number, I think. Or, not even number. You guys know what I mean. <laughs> Alright, uh... I got 47 wheat. Oh. There must not have been one that... Uh, my keyboard keeps on lagging on me so I have to actually go get a new keyboard today because uh, this one's starting to die I think it's getting too old too old for a keyboard we've I've actually had it for uh, that scared me for uh, a little while now it's been I think a couple like, maybe two or three years no nope. of course not of course there's no melons why would there be all right Let's turn that all into bread. Now we got our bread and our melon. And um, let's go and we will breed a cow. You and you. And as soon as you have a baby, you're gonna die. Awesome. Now we got three steak as well. And let's actually head off in. Hmm direction let's go east east has never failed me before go around the death games and on through the woods to offward to grandma's house we go so pretty much like I said we're just uh, gonna go scout out for a new house location probably like a hundred blocks out grab some obsidian which is something I don't have of course I don't have it I'm always underprepared. <laughs> Alright. Pull it out of that. And, uh, what my goal is is to just head east for probably like a thousand blocks and try to actually find one of the newer biomes so then that way we can actually get it and, uh, have that going on. So, uh, while I do that, you guys can, uh, sit back and relax and I will see you when I get there. Alright guys, I am back after my long expedition, and I think we have found the perfect spot to set up camp. We actually found a, uh, a plains biome. Let's put my bed here next to these cute little pigs. Hello. You're going to be dinner. I'm naming you bacon, you pork chop, you sausage, and you are going to be named Bob. Bob the pig. Got to keep one of them alive. <laughs> and uh, out of my peripheral vision, as you can see, like from back here, I wasn't able to see it. Whenever I turned my head, I saw that village over there in the corner. So let's go actually check that out and see what they have. So then that way we can actually get um, uh, some villagers and possibly trade with them. So then that way we can... Uh, get some cool things and so what I'm going to be doing is the house that I'm going to oh they have a blacksmith awesome the uh, the house that I'm going to be building is not going to be just a house I'm actually going to build like a ranch yes they have some obsidian so like the uh, the ranch that I'm going to build is it's sort of going to just be a big ranch with uh, cow pastures and other things like that and there were some horses there so we are able to get a horse and ride it around. Hmm. 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 What do you have? Hmm. You have a bad trade. Huh. Yourself. Alright, you have a bad trade. Man. Does anyone here do wheat? You do wheat. Alright, you are good. You're staying alive. Hmm. To all you guys. <laughs> Oh, I love the uh, the villagers. Whenever they didn't make noise, it was 
It was very weird, just walking around and watching him get killed by zombies. They're just like... Just sort of like jumping while they're getting hit. It's like, can you at least say ow? <laughs> so it looks like uh, right next to this we got a forest biome. And, ooh, we got a sheep. Sheepy, sheepy, sheep. Brown little sheep. I'm going to turn you pink. Do I have any bones? Yes, I do. Do I have... No, I don't have the one ingredient I need. Wow. Alright, well, I know what I'm going to do. Drink my strength potion. Uh, eat another piece of bread. Or two, depending... <laughs> And now we are off to go and grab one other item that we need for the uh, the sheep. Uh, is that red? Oh, that's a mushroom. You lied to me, mushroom. You lied to me. There's quite a few sheep and pigs around here. Around the, uh, there it is. Yes. <laughs> awesome. Now, time for the moment of glory. Come here, sheep. Let's go back up to the village and die these sheep. Alright. So, I'm going to go die them. And then, uh, I'm going to make sure all these villagers actually stay out of harm's way. Don't want to die the brown sheep. Brown sheep are kind of rare. Die you two. Pink sheep. So let's actually set up the portal. Uh, where to? Hmm. Do it, a villager. Hmm. <laughs> you know, let's actually set it up right here. All right. We just need one, two, three more pieces. So let's actually go down into the mines, get that, and so the, like I said, I'm kind of going to build a ranch house with a uh, large, it's going to be like a couple acres of uh, the fences, add some trees and all that other cool junk, walk around these piggies. You know, the one thing that I forgot to grab, torches. Does the blacksmith have any? Hmm. hmm. Does the blacksmith have any coal in that chest? Did we see any? No, there's an iron chest plate. Let's actually store some junk. Pop those in there. All of that. We'll keep that on us. Uh... Hmm, what else do we need? Oh, I know what we can do. Sixteen. And... Hmm, my, ooh, my keyboard's acting up. Like I said, I need to get a new one. Otherwise, I'm going to be in trouble. Alright. So we're going to let those cook, and that's just going to give us the torches that we need. And uh, I think I'll probably cut it here, because I don't think anything interesting is going to happen, except for it becoming nighttime. So I will see you guys whenever I get that obsidian and get that portal made. Alright guys, I'm back. I didn't find the obsidian yet, but we do have a mine shaft. Let's go exploring, shall we? Alright. So, usually these things have, like, uh, quite a few chests. And what I'm actually trying to look for is a possible... Or, uh, yep, there it is. It's no longer a possible this. Ow. Ugh. That is brutal. Get over there. Ugh. Cave spiders. Ow, ow. Ugh. Their poison sure does last a long time. Oh, and there goes my keyboard again. 
Alright. Yeah, their keyboard, or this keyboard is, uh, I think it's dead. It's finally done. It's on its last leg. It's kicked the bucket. <laughs> All the other things that say that you're dead. Hmm. And if I will not be darned, the only thing that I forgot whenever I came out here was a st my stinking fortune pick. I brought my silk touch, soft touch pick, but I forgot my fortune. So what that means is that we need to really get this nether portal, because if I find like any diamonds or that, I can't use them unless I get that fortune. Oh, alright, we have two spawners, not too terribly far from each other. So we might actually be able to do something with that. Try to uh, make a cave spider farm. Just like uh, Etho had in his uh, man cave. So. Alright. Well, it um, doesn't look like there's anything interesting. I will actually come back to you if I find anything interesting at all. Alright, well I was able to find something here. It was actually this... Uh, this chest right here. Have not looked in it yet. And then also I found this. This is pretty cool. Two, two tall grass in uh, the middle of a, a thing. Oh, pumpkin and melon seeds. Nice. Those are something I forgot to bring as well. Alright. I ran out of torches as well. So. We are short supply. Really should have prepared for this. And since I don't have my... Uh, fortune pick all that coal that how much gravel is there all the uh the coal that I'm mine I can't really use unless I actually get some so all right well that's about all that I wanted to show you on on that so see you whenever I find something interesting or get the obsidian all right guys I am back I did find something else that is actually pretty interesting you guys might want to uh, to check this out. It's uh, if I can actually get some torches, I really do need to buy a new keyboard. Man, that sucks. All right, well let's actually go and see if we can grab this torch over here. One. Let's grab these. We need at least four for the thing that I found. Alright, and so that was that way, so we went this way, and around here, and it is right down, I think, this way. Yeah, it's right here. I found a zombie spotter. Of all things. Two, three, five, oh. Let's actually take you and put you right there. Awesome. So we got three saddles, couple bit of wheat. That, let's uh, throw in that gravel and that piece of cobble. Don't need that, so uh, let me take a screenshot of the cords. Good. Let's get rid of this little guy. You're annoying. Go away. So... Oh, there's some flowers down here. Nice. So, yeah, I'll be back whenever I find that obsidian. Alright, guys, I'm back, and lucky, 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 I actually did find some lava. So, we're going to go ahead and get this. Oh, of course, I have to make another crafting table. <laughs> so, uh, we're actually going to make a bucket to collect this. And what else could I toss? Gunpowder I do not need. And... Oh, I have some coal. Nice. Let's actually go ahead and make some sticks. Craft up those torches. Toss those sticks, because they will take up my inventory. And right around the corner here, I actually did find something else. 
I found a zombie spotter. Another one right here, so <laughs> getting pretty lucky today on all these uh all these interesting finds. So let's actually go ahead and toss that stuff. Got plenty of that. Don't need that spider eye. There's a zombie over there. Oh, there's some water. Yes. Alright, so let's actually go ahead and get this obsidian. We actually only need three more pieces. Ooh. Man, we are going to be rich. Here you go, zombie. <laughs> Take an arrow to the face. Alright, let's actually uh, go back here, because as you saw there... Oh, no. No! <laughs> oh, just great. It's almost dead, too. And I did find the gold wrecker. We found a... Or, I'll show you the hall whenever, uh, whenever we get back to my uh, ranch area. So then I can show you all the cool things that I got. And then we do really need to build this because we actually need to get to the, uh, back to spawn to go and get my fortune pick. So then that way I can actually use all this diamond. Man, this was a good cave run. I mean, I found two spawners. I found quite a bit of diamond. The only really thing that I need is just to, uh, to fight the wither. So I can get the beacon and put haste on it. And then, man, I'll be set. And then whenever we do that, we can actually uh, do, if you guys have watched Ethos Lab and uh, his speedrun thing. Do we have room for that? Yeah, we have room for that. Which one did we pick up? Oh, we picked up both. All right. He uh, he did a speedrun, or not speedrun, uh, speed mining tutorial. And in it, all that he did was he just went down to about Y12, I think it was. And then he put a haste to beacon. And then he just went crazy in it. He was able to get a lot of stuff with that. I mean, <laughs> way more than I got today. Oh, there's a skeleton. Let's take that torch. And we'll pillar up, and I will see you whenever we get up there. Alright, guys, we are back up on the surface that I actually dug up right here, which was actually kind of cool. So, I'm actually just going to do that. And we'll toss the rest of that stone. So, uh, this is the hall that I... Oh, no. Wait a second. Let's get rid of him. Anyone else? It does not look like it. Alright, so this is the haul that we got. We actually got a Sharpness 3 Looting 2 Efficiency 3 books. I could put that on a sword, sort of like this, but I have this one already. Uh, so we have a Sharpness 3 as well. Music disc, horse armor, 12 diamonds. So it's a pretty nice haul. We got 3 iron. 18 coal, 1 redstone, or we got more than 1 redstone because I mean, uh, we got this up here. We got how many saddles? We got, looks like, 5 saddles. We got 2 horse armors, the gold one and the iron. I have the diamond inside my ender chest. We got iron, so we're going to take one of those. We got redstone, some gold, a name tag, the saddles, a potato from a zombie. Then we got five melon seeds, two pumpkin seeds, and all of that. Those 12 diamonds are going to uh, really suit us with that. <laughs> Alright, let's actually... I don't know how to... Uh, uh, whatever, I'll just do that. Alright, so we're actually, I'm going to place that back 
let's go and build this nether portal and then I will see you guys in we're gonna call it an episode as soon as I do that where is the village peripheral vision village village it must be over here if it's not it's the other direction but as soon as and I'm thinking it is the other direction unless the village disappeared <laughs> yeah it's probably the other direction so what we're gonna do is like I said we're just gonna build that nether portal and then as soon as we do that we're gonna call it quits for today and then we'll see you guys again in the next episode so then that way we can continue our adventure and uh, off camera at the end of this episode I'm actually gonna go and I'm gonna get the uh, my supplies uh, what what supplies the um uh... oh I just had a brain fart oh my fortune pick I'm gonna go and grab that and uh... go grab the leads that I have so then that way we can get the uh... these animals to where we want them especially those pink sheep and once we do that I think we will be good let's actually try to get oh, come on just need a piece of flint. Come on, piece of flint. With the uh, <laughs> all the stuff I had, was not able to get one single solitary piece of flint. Oh come on! You are very stingy gravel. You know that, right? Oh wow. You know, usually by now I've actually gotten. There we go. Piece of flint. So I, the recipe. There we go. Usually I always build that wrong. I'm like, and here's the recipe. Nope. See, I can remember every other recipe in Minecraft except for the stinking flint and steel. It's the only thing. So let's. Boom. Need to grab another. Wah, wah, da da da. We got some nice music playing in the background for the ending of the episode. And, alright, there's our nether portal, guys. I'll see you guys in the next episode when we will actually start building our ranch home. And then, whenever we do that, we can gather up all these animals and then we'll go on from there. Alright, see you guys later.